nominate a candidate who is simply Democrat light, what's the point? <laughs> Why bother? All right, that was Senator Rand Paul from earlier today. Uh, big issues. Indiana, Arkansas, Religious Freedom Restoration Act. And I want to talk about that. What is your take on the Religious Freedom Restoration Act and, and the Indiana bill, the 1993 bill signed by Hillary Clinton's husband? I guess, what, I guess what's amazing to me is that it's necessary. I would have thought, you know, and it, this was for the debate when our founding started, is our founding fathers debated over even having a Bill of Rights. They thought it would be so understood that you had the right to express your religious liberty that no one would ever question it. And some thought if you listed the Bill of Rights, well, then people would think that was all of your rights. And so I think our founders would be uh, aghast that anyone would think that they could tell you what to do, something to perform a ceremony or be part of a ceremony that's against your or uh, religious beliefs. You know, that being said, though, I think the law ought to be neutral, and I don't, I don't think we ought to treat people unfairly, and, you know, I'm all for treating people with respect and tolerance, right. but at the same time, what, I can't what imagine telling the rub a comes? Christian... You can use any example. A baker that maybe doesn't want to put on a cake, Allahu Akbar, right. or everyone keeps bringing up gay rights issues. Does religious liberty trump which takes precedence in, in your mind? Well, I don't think you can have coercion in a free society very well. I mean, they, don't, they just don't, they seem to be antagonistic. So I would think that we ought to try freedom in most of these things, and that also people ought to understand that people's opinions change through persuasion. And if I really want to convince you to come to my political way of beliefs or my religious beliefs, you know, I don't go to evangelism, like if I go to Africa, I don't evangelize by forcing you to accept my religion. I've got to convince you to. So if people want to convince people that other forms of marriage are fine, they need to do it through persuasion. Right, let me ask you this. You've really gone out of your way more than any candidate in the Republican side to reach out to historically black colleges and audiences that are not traditionally either conservative, libertarian, or Republican. Um, and, you, and you got into a bit of a controversy on, in an NBC interview. Shouldn't surprise anybody. Surprise. I, you, you, but you actually devoted uh, like yeah. almost a chapter in your book about this. Yeah. And it has to do with you support the Civil Rights Act except for Article 2. Right. In other words, and it, it kind of it is a similar issue in as much as do people have a right to discriminate? Why don't you support the Article 2? And does that mean that if somebody wants to be a bigot, a racist, a jerk, what does it mean? Well, first of all, I do support the Civil Rights Act and right. always have. And I think what made me maddest about the interview is that liberals twisted and turned. And it made it impossible to have a, a sane discussion over it or to have any kind of nuance of belief. But the Civil Rights Act, I would have voted for. In fact, the Civil Rights Act, 83% of Republicans voted for it and about 40% of Democrats voted for it. In fact, the filibuster, the longest filibuster in the history of the Senate, is right. Democrats trying to block civil rights. Right. So Republicans really have been the champion of civil rights. And I do support and always have supported the Civil Rights Act. In fact, I've been one of those who truly, I think, is on the cusp of saying, you know what, we need to defend minority rights and we haven't done a good right. enough job even in today's but, day and age. You, but this is what's interesting to me because you have made an effort to really reach out to the black community, historically black colleges. You go into this interview and you said, yeah, I support nine out of the ten. I would modify right. Article 2. Right. What's the modification? Does that then allow an American to discriminate based on race? No, and I think there's a difference between accommodation and, and, and uh, religious ceremonies. And so I don't think we should. And we decided that, you know, back in 1964. So that's, that's a decided question. I don't think we okay. should discriminate. So what would the modification that. be then? I think that uh, the question is, is whether or not we apply it to other things. And that was the point I tried to make at that point. Yeah. Do we apply it to smoking? Do we apply it to handguns? Can you be forced, if you're a restaurant owner, to allow someone to enter who has a handgun if it's a bar? And you say, well, I don't these think drinking tough, and guns mix. These are tough legal questions. Right. And the thing is, is these are esoteric and philosophic questions. And you want to figure it out? If you're on a left-wing show that only cares about hating on, Demo on, hating on Republicans, yeah. they don't really care about nuance or philosophical Are you convinced that you can get a higher percentage of the black vote in America, the Hispanic vote in America, the minority vote in America? Do you think this outreach will pay off for them? Because the numbers aren't good, 90%. 
I'll every tell presidential you the, election. I, I don't know. I will yeah. do everything I can to try to get more minority vote. I also realize that until the Republican Party becomes more diverse, we won't win. And I'll say the one evidence that shows that I might be able to is that when you poll me against Hillary Clinton in blue states, purple yeah. states. You win in three. I'm, I'm doing better than any other Republican. That's because I get independent right. vote and because I think I'm getting a percentage of the minority vote. I'm going to ask you about Hillary and potential candidate, uh, fellow competitors in this uh, primary. We'll get to that.